Welcome to the channel. Uh, today, I just wanted to do basically like a continuation, also uh, a just a, a show of the possibilities of Turo uh, for your business, and allow you to be able to create something that can create cash flow. Right? Again, uh, my goal, one of the goals of this channel, is to create opportunities or give a mindset, create knowledge. My, the Bible says, "My people perish for lack of knowledge." To increase your knowledge in regards to the options that are out there for you to be able to put your mind to work. Uh, line your line up your life up with the fact that we should be fruitful and multiply. Also, allow you the opportunity to be able to be the man that provides, but also um, that provides in a way that is um, spiritual um, as well as uh, natural, right? And, and meaning that uh, you will be bearing fruit. So, when, you, when your wives, your family look at you, they're going to see you working hard if you have a nine to five, but also having a business that's creating cash flow, having multiple streams of income, which is what we're called to do. Uh, that's how we provide for our family, that's how we look out, that's why we make sure that if something should happen to us, uh, that uh, things will keep moving forward. You must accomplish that. It's, uh, it's important, right? And so uh, we're going to start off by looking at, and it's beautiful, like uh, congratulations to me, I have, uh, we have made Power Host. And so uh, what that means is that we get access to information that we did not have before, uh, that everybody didn't have before. So I'm going to uh, do this thing here that I'm excited about, uh, that... Uh, uh, it means a lot to me to be able to do this. Uh, I'm going to call uh, Turo Support, and I want you to uh, hear uh, how they answer the phone, uh, knowing that it's my uh, my phone that's calling. So um, that I'm calling. So let's uh, let's do this. Calling Turo, and for being a power host to report a late return. So you got to love that. I mean, that, I, I do that every like once a week just to, <laughs> just to hear, oh my God, I'm a power host, right? And again, I'm going to show you what that means. Again, uh, that requires that you uh, build a business uh, that you want to scale. Build a business that um, you're doing with excellence. Build a business that uh, you're determined to succeed and make that money uh, for your family, for yourself, for your uh, to create cash flow to line up with bearing fruit. And so, July, so what's happening to me is like my business, was, so we start off with this beautiful story about achieving the goal. My goal was like, I knew I could, it was possible, but I had to see it actually practically done. And so we hit 10,472 in April, and we did that with 13 cars. We've since then lost four of those cars. They were part of an investment group, and so they have those back. Uh, but then we had to adjust. I said, can we do, you know, Maurice, how do we do this? How do we be efficient with what we have? And so we were down to eight, nine cars, eight cars uh, to actually working. One of them is the Tesla um, that I don't put out there because the rates are not really uh, productive right now. And so uh, in May, we had uh, one of those cars. So that's really not a true number. And so, but in June, June is when it really was um, um, the opportunity to show what can be done. If you're on it every day, you're looking, you're adjusting the numbers, you're looking at the responses and so forth. And so with that, uh, we were able to do 7311. I knew that there would be more be possible because of the, I believe that in that month the, um, the Mercedes was underutilized and I think there's a video that talks about that. So then I had to say, you know what, this is possible, we can do it, let's see what happens if we uh, maximize all the vehicles, push them to their limit, um, in this every day, checking the data, uh, working the numbers, um, and making sure, you know, even change descriptions, adding photos, making sure everything, you know, what does the listing look like, things like that. And so. I'm so proud of the fact that we were able to do it. So 7,564 uh, is what we have achieved. And so my goal was 7,500, 8,000 uh, was my high goal. And to achieve 7,500 after a 7,311 month um, means that this is real business and means that um, we're moving in the right direction. So 70, I'm using 7,500 as my means. So therefore I can say, you know what, based on what we have, what we're working with, uh, 7,500 is, is actually something we can count on um, because this month started off really slow. Uh, so typically you can see right now, the beautiful thing is $5,900 is what we had in booked in reservations for August and this was before we were even in August, right? And so uh, so that's a good thing, that's a good start, right? So, we, and so like, we're on track to be able to, I'm hoping to hit that high goal of 8,000 and I'll do a video to show if we do that or uh, when we do that. And so 7564, again, uh, a great milestone for me, a great opportunity for me to see uh, that this thing works if you grind in, if you get in there, put it and, and go after it, right? And so let me show you. We, I did a video about the two star cars, and, um, and they were Hondas. And so I want to show you how it came out uh, with the numbers in regards to these cars. And again, I'll even show you the Mercedes to see how we went from uh, what it was in uh, June to what it had became in July, uh, just so you can understand my business. So this is... So 75, 
75.64 for the entire month of July. And then this is how it broke down by car. And again, uh, I'm, I'm on the economy model. I'm not the guy that I'm not gonna get any G wagons. I'm not gonna get any you know, high uh, value cars. I'm gonna just crunch out the numbers, put some economy cars to work, um, end up the math work. And I saw that during uh, the slow for uh, beginning of July, that those are the cars that came in and took care of business, right? And so if you look, this is the 2014 Honda Elantra. And uh, last month it did nine, uh, in June it did 981. And in uh, July it did 917. Again, uh, we talked about this, this car cost me $6,200 before tax and license, right? So that's a really good number. So we're looking at when this is when I first put it on, on the platform, 598. Now it said, and then it went to 865. Uh, then it went to 981. And then it went to uh, 917. So not bad at all and it's already uh, we've got reservations on it for 588 for the month of August so uh, well done right but um, I remember what uh, I was talking about man this Honda Elantra is kicking it kicking you know doing really well and it's you know it's beating up on the on the Honda Sonata and so I'm like maybe you know I'm trying to figure out why one does been the other uh, I figured the Sonata would be a bigger car so you know you have more features uh, and so I didn't understand why it was getting um, you know beat down by the, the Elantra but uh, and so I think it must have heard me and so for the, for the month of uh, July, it hit 1,087. So remember that in um, in June it did 762. Look at this number again. This car I believe cost me seven thousand dollars, and uh, 1,087 it made in that month. And so look at this business: 709, then 751, then 762. Again, it started in this month in April. So uh, I was looking back and I'm realizing, you know what? This car should have gotten its credit, credibility back in the day because it's been consistently doing what it needs to do. Uh, for a while there, whereas I think on the on the Elantra, uh, it didn't start off as well as the uh, Sonata did. But Sonata must have heard me and said, you know, I said, you know what, you got me mixed up. Uh, this is what we do, and so it, it, it brought in 1,087 uh, for the month of July, and so it's already got reservations for 794 dollars for the month of August. And so I'm doing this video on August 2nd. So uh, these numbers booked in uh, on, the, of course, in the end of July, August 1st. So i uh, just excited about that. So now let's talk about what it means to be a power host. Again, uh, there's some criteria for that. Uh, you have to be an all-star host. Uh, you have to um, you know, have an amount of trips and, and some other things that go into doing that. And so you gotta be taking care of your business. And so, but the beautiful benefit, I love data. I'm all about crunching numbers. I literally, when I'm like, how do I get these cars to maximum utilization based on what I have, right? I'm not, uh, and the beautiful thing right now, I'm at the stage of my business where I'm literally figuring it out. I'm literally creating it in, in a way that to so be able to see and get data. What kind of cars work? Uh, what kind of numbers can they get? Uh, what kind of acquisition price can you get them for and put them to work and what kind of return can you get in an investment? And so uh, there's cars right now that um, you know they're putting to work and they're working really hard. Are they gonna be the, there in the long term? They may not be. So uh, the model may be for those cars that I, I work them as, this, as they usually help me to build the business and see the numbers so when I go to buy cars, I'm like, okay, we'll get the Honda will work, uh, the Nissans will work, or you know, if we can get another Mercedes, that'll work, right? And so, uh, let me go back because I promised you to show you the Mercedes numbers and I didn't do it. So let me go back and show you what the Mercedes did. So, uh, the Mercedes, I love this car, it's my wife's car, but the beautiful thing about it is that it proves a model. Like, it allows my wife to be able to see and understand uh, that everything works and that you would, what kind of return you can get if you put, you know, the car to work. So, you love the car. Um, but we're trying to show some numbers, trying to show that how imagine if we could take that car, it pays its own payment, pays for its insurance, and then it, it generates income that you can use to do whatever you want to do with, right? Pay some bills, whatever it is you got going on. I mean, that's life, right? Imagine if you do, could do that, put that asset to work for that, be able to generate income, take care of itself, and then and then give you uh, overflow, and then you just duplicate that. I mean, you could even use that to, to the point where you can use that car to pay for the car you really want. You know, maybe you want a, a 2023 G-Wagon, which is, a, I believe, is my wife's desire, but uh, we'll see how that works out. But again, it's a math number, right? And so if you look here, so for July, it did $1,122. Remember, I talked about the fact that it was underutilized in June. It only did $749 in June. Now it's at $1,122 in July. So come on, right? And so let's go now. Let me show you. Uh, the power of being a power host and the access you get. So they do give you insight. They give you statistics. They give you data, uh, so you can look at your business. All right. And so uh, you know, I'm so thankful uh, to see really truly the hard work that I'm putting in there, uh, the determination to give a high level of service and create and, and provide a great product. Um, and again, you any we can do this. You know, if you have the information, if you have the uh, desire to do it, if you have a work ethic, if you have a desire to serve people, 
can, you can build a business and you can build one that will create income so that you can, um, you know, make a choice whether you want to do 9 to 5 or do 9 to 5 plus an income stream, right? Uh, my heart is to be able to one day be able to not have to do 9 to 5 and be able to have this uh, business replace my income. And as you've seen, 10,000 was my number. We achieved that with the right car. So really I'm at right now is just a matter of, uh, which is confirmed for me by the numbers we did in July, I just need more cars, right? And typically for me, I'm trying to do this business, least amount of cars, getting a great amount of revenue. You want to be efficient, right? So if you look at what is provided to you by being a power host, it's absolutely beautiful. So I'm in the San Diego, California marketplace. And I put the nine cars selected, um, you know, listed previ uh, previous month. And so let's see if we can do, yeah, previous month would have been uh, July, right? And so look at the beautiful thing that you get here. So I get literally at the sea. Uh, eight cars are working again that Tesla is, is you know, we're doing some other things with that so we're not putting that to work but uh, so of the eight active cars uh, average trip earnings were $840 per vehicle average uh, trip earnings are $39 uh, median book price is $40 uh, average utilization was 69% uh, average five uh, average car page view so again when the people go to the tour website and they look in there you know how many you know they're looking at your cars and then what are they doing and so I had 562 was the average for views on my cars and then 3.81 percent was the average car page conversion which means that they, they looked at the car they saw the listing they clicked on it and they booked it right and so that's powerful that's powerful to be able to see that right that means that you're doing a bunch of things right that means that your descriptions are good your photos are good um, and all you can do is, you know, you want to look at that. You have these numbers, so then now you can like tweak the business. See what else can I do? What, you know, get some information. Go out there, join some uh, tour groups, and talk to other people, and say, you know, you know, what can I do to, to be more efficient to get to increase these numbers, right? And so, this is comparing me against the entire uh, marketplace of San Diego uh, with sim with the exact car and then similar cars, right? And so again, this is just the vehicle, and then we have uh, the month, right? So. Lifetime, 53,490, uh, 309 set trips, 3.6 average trip duration, right? And so we love that. But the mo the thing that I, I love the most is this, um, well, I'll go through all of it. I just get excited. But uh, So this one's the performance benchmarks, right? So there you can see, you can see what you've got um, uh, going on for vehicle compared to the marketplace. So it's the same model. There are 18 cars in my marketplace, the Hyundai, Sonata, Hyundai launched 2014. Uh, we did 917, they did 689. So if you look, the top row is mine, and then the bottom row. So come on, we're taking care of business. So if you need someone, if you if you have a car and you're just like, hey, let me send it to Sandy and let this dude Maurice put it to work because he looks like he knows what he's doing, let's do it. You know, get a call, get a hold of me, put something in comments, and, and get a hold of me. I love to do that. I, I, I do. A, I have a high level of service. I believe in producing and putting out a great product. I love people, uh, and so you know, definitely. Uh, your car will be maximized and you should see that I mean, the numbers speak right and so if you can look and see this again in my marketplace San Diego California with these cars these economy cars uh, look what I'm killing I'm beating people down right uh, so right here you know there I'm going neck and neck on the Mercedes I got one point eleven hundred dollars there eleven hundred dollars what they're doing for the other three cars in there a uh, thousand on the, the Altima I mean just I mean the top rows up look at this right so Beautiful utilization. A high, I have a higher utilization than uh, than the marketplace. All right, medium price. He's like, oh, well, of course you're doing that because you got lower prices there. But no, look at this. Uh, the pri I pricing is uh, is beating them down. My price is equal or greater uh, than the marketplace for similar car, for the exact car, right? And so same model car. And so then you know page views. And this is a beautiful thing, right? So literally, um, I had 349 on the Elantra. But look at this. Uh, the Mercedes is getting 1.9. Uh, almost 2,000 uh, page views on the Mercedes, right? And then the, it has a car page conversion. It didn't convert because every time they looked at the car, they booked it. So there was nothing to convert because there was not the car wasn't available because it was booked, right? So if you look through here and you see, you know, uh, the cars are getting seen, right? And, and again, we're talking about economy cars. We're not talking about anything great, you know, 2000, you know, anything like 2015 uh, Nissan Altima, 2014 Nissan Al Altima. Uh, 2016 Mercedes, 2013 Honda. So we, you know what I'm saying here, right? And then you look at the conversion. Look at this, a 9.21% conversion. They see the car, they see the listing, and they book it. Compared to everybody else, look at this, okay? And they book it. And so you want to be able to um, run your business this way. And it's possible, I'm nobody, I'm just a guy that is determined, that's driven, uh, prays a lot, 
um, believes that you can be successful and we're made to be successful in our purpose and I believe that there's I mean I even I mean I, I just anticipate what I could do with this business but right now like with my eight cars um, I am really proving the concept so that when I go to try to raise money and improve and, and, and scale I can show that you know I put in the work right as I was talking to guys yesterday about seed time and harvest you got to you have to plant the seed, which means you got to do something. If God gives you something hard, if something's on your heart to do, to do the work, uh, start a business, start it, right? It's going to be, it's going to be beautiful. And maybe, you know, like, I don't know anything about business. It doesn't, doesn't matter. Start the process. And in doing it, in the time of doing it, you will literally be developed and see and see the opportunities and get better and then better and then better and then be able to uh, scale and be able to take it. But you have to start. You have to plant the seed, right? You're not, you can't have harvest. You can't talk about wanting to uh, be able to create streams of income, being able to provide for your family without you having to be the number one guy working hard and, and sweating death and dealing with all the public and so forth. You don't want to talk about, just talk about that. You don't want to just talk about harvest. You want to plant the seed and put in the time and do it, right? And so you, if you do that, you will be able to develop and work it out. Again, I'm nobody. I'm just a guy, but I'm determined, right? And so, based on what God's given me, I've been able to work with it. I'm putting it out there, putting it to work, and this is the results that we're having, right? And this is my most, the next one is my, I love this thing. This is trends, right? And so, utilization. Again, this blue line is, is, is uh, my business. And then there's the uh, light blue line, light gray line, let me show you here. The light gray line is the same vehicle, same models. And then the, uh, the dark gray one is similar cars, right? And so if you look on utilization, I, you know, I, I'm just blessed. Like I'm looking at my cars, I'm like, I literally have no cars. I'm like, every car that I have is being maximized. Look at this. This is my utilization compared to San Diego, California, nine cars selected, listed. All right, and this, I did it from January of 2023. So this is January, from the beginning of January, all the way through, right? This is low down here, because we're not in that month yet. So we can't cut, you can't count utilization over there because they're not there yet. But look at what happened, look at July. Uh, look at August based on booked uh, resume. Look at what we got going in for, uh, you know, September. You know, September is not coming yet. So we get, look at this, right? That's, that's, that's success, right? And it's success um, doing, being scrappy, working what you have to work with, with how God has blessed you and, and the opportunity to present yourself. You have to, you know, use what you have, right? I can, if you can't maximize what you have, if you, you know, I, I truly believe that, uh, and it's all over, that um, God has given us the develop to be management. We need to manage what we've been given, right? And if you're a good manager, uh, then you'll get more uh, opportunities to manage, right? And so medium uh, book price. So if you see this one is, I guess, the uh, same model, and then these are similar cars. So look at that. What you're doing, you're doing well, right? And so same thing here. Look at this. Average trip earnings per book day. We're in there. We're in there taking care of business. And then this one, average car page views, right? They're being drawn to us, right? Imagine if I had said, oh man, I can't do this, it's too risky, I can't, I don't have time, all kinds of excuses. Then I would not be in a place where people could actually come and view something that we've created in the name of Jesus, right? Look at this, okay? This happened because I made a step. Again, I got a great education, I'm driven, I pray a lot, but I'm still a regular guy just like you. If I can do it, you can do it. Right, and just gotta get started. Try, you know, just get the car you have, put the work, don't do any airport delivery, just have come get your house and just work through the concept, work through the process, step by step, right? So I'm gonna stop there so that I don't make this thing too long. Um, hopefully you get it. Um, but again, I'm motivated and driven that you guys can do this. I will help you. I mean, again, uh, I'm, eventually I'll have some kind of course or something like that, but right now I'm just, you know, uh, and the course will be really just to show the, 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 the deep dive into, not just to show you how to do the business. I mean, you can find it anywhere. But it's going to be like a deal. How is it's personal, right? What did I personally have to go through? What did I personally deal with on a daily basis? What kind of pushback did I get, you know, uh, to really try to create something, right? And my hope is that as I do this channel uh, and I do this tour segment of it, that you're going to see, because again, I'm going to have to car share, you're going to see uh, that uh, we are, um, that it's possible, that we're going to see us build this business up. Right? My goal is $25,000 a month by the end of the, the year, $35,000 for next year, right? You got to aim high, right? You've got to get an opportunity to think out of the box. You've got the opportunity to be big, right? So go big, go think for big things. Go pray for big things. This is it. Go, pray, go for big things, right? And so, you know, the bigger thing you go for, you know, you know, if you get close, hey, come on, that's, that's you know, you're close to big, right? And so don't limit yourself and don't put God in the box and don't limit him.